Hey guys, this is going to be another quick Linux command video. Check the link in the description for more info and for copy and paste examples. The Linux TLDR command provides a really quick command info that is concise, practical, and useful. So TLDR, so yeah, this provides really concise, quick info. Just if you want to find out what a command does really quickly, um, this is the command to use. Now it serves a similar purpose to the man help or info pages, except that it provides the most practical info in a really concise format. So let's try this out. Now this is probably not installed. So TLDR, command not found. Most distros it's probably not installed by default. So I'm going to install this. I don't have sudo installed on this host at the moment, but uh, anyways, apt install tldr so install it as root you could also use sudo if you have that set up so install tldr and there we go so most places you're going to have to install this use whatever package manager your system has but now we have so tldr and i may need to actually do another thing for this to work let's try this out tldr ls so downloading the pages okay good so that's one thing it it's it's going to be slow now to start but it looks like in this case it's automatically downloading the pages when i i'm on debian right now when i was on ubuntu it did not do that for me uh, one thing you can do you can say tldr dash u to update the database pages so you can do this once when you first start as part of the installation process and that will download all of the pages for everything that way it won't you know, it won't hang there and download the page for whatever command you're looking to uh, to look info up for. So yeah, like tldr ls, tldr find, right? So this is really, you can see how useful this is. This just gives you, like for the find command, this will, it tells you find, it tells you what it does, it finds directories and files and stuff recursively, and it gives you some basic uh, basic examples of how you most common examples of things you would do with a find command with a short description for each thing like this tells you how to find files matching multiple file um, you know path name patterns right and it gives you an example and you can basically figure out what to do with each of these not comprehensive documentation like the manner info pages but it gives you a lot of quick practical stuff for example if you don't remember the syntax for a command or if for example you don't um, you know you you, you if you if you're able to figure things like this out really quick and you just don't know the syntax is a quick way to just look up how to use a command so you could do t another example would be tldr grep right you can look up the most common things like using extended regular expressions and stuff like that it isn't always um i believe you can use like a dash e or something i forget off the top of my head but um instead of saying dash dash extended regex like like you don't uh, it may not always give you the, all of the best options, so it's still worth looking into the man pages and looking at some more common um, usages for commands. But um, this is a really quick, so it's not perfect. I've noticed some of the examples are not always the best, and it doesn't use every single option there is. Um, you know, so sometimes it's it may miss things. It may not give you the best options to use or or, or whatever else. But it, it's great for giving a quick summary and getting you up and running really quickly if you don't have time or don't want to, you know, spend the time to do you know more research or whatever. So um, yeah, you can do that with a uh, rep find ls or what, whatever commands you have. A little bit more simple output for ls shows you a bunch of things you can do with it. And uh, yeah, that's basically the TLDR command. It's really useful, really handy. Um, I love having it, so definitely take a look at that, If you're, especially if you're new to Linux. This will help you get up and running with different commands really quickly. Um, not a complete substitute for the man pages. And uh, yeah, just so um, definitely get used to using the man pages too, especially if you want to search for obscure options and uh, if you want to make sure you're using the optimal options for everything uh, worth it. This is not a replacement for the man pages. So that's about it. That's everything I wanted to show you for the TLDR command. Remember, check the links in the description for more info. Hit the subscribe button for more useful content like this. We also have a ton of other more interesting content covering things like coding, hardware, software, servers, Raspberry Pis, 3D printing, and a whole lot more. Hopefully you found this useful. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you guys on that next video.